Hello everyone, my name is Sky, and today, welcome to another installment of Sky Talks About Random Things You Saw Recently. <laughs> um, so, I recently saw that there is a celebrity who has set her boundaries, you know, has said, hey guys, I don't feel comfortable with you guys doing this, and I reserve the right to say no to things, right? And I'm like good on you you know setting boundaries is a great thing the amount of people who felt entitled to 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 just like no you owe us this was weird was definitely weird um and it made me think that this is a discussion i would like to have because while celebrities and youtubers are different they are also alike in many ways and especially with uh celebrity culture being a big thing um, and one of the things I wanted to, to first say, number one, you are paying to the people who are like, I'm paying, you know, and supporting her so she can at least give me a photo. You are paying for the product, not the person. You are paying for her songs. You are paying for her, um, performances. You are paying for that you are not paying for the person i feel like i can't believe that has to be said you know unfortunately that is a thing i don't find you know fans bad i don't find the fact that there's a lot of people who you know buy merch that like this is their fa- their this is their oh she type of thing no i find you guys awesome i find you guys chill the ones that are chill the ones that go too far, we have issues. Because I feel like most people are respectful enough to understand that if, a, if like, going up to a celebrity or going up to a YouTuber and being like, hey, can I get a photo with you? And they're like, oh, I'm sorry, not right now. Or they're going to be like, oh, yeah, no, that's fine, and walk away. Just like, thanks for letting me meet you, you know? I feel like most people are good with that. But then there's the people that are like, well, I don't care if you're busy. You're supposed to take a photo with me. That I'm like, what? Dude. I am one of those people who, 100%, I'm fans of people. 100%. But I will never go up to them in public. Unless it is a official meet and greet, I will not go up to them. And I'm not saying people who do go up to them in, in public are bad people. I'm just saying be respectful, understand when no means no. Um, I'm just not one of those who will go up to them. Because for me, I feel like I wouldn't like that, you know? I wouldn't like someone coming up to me while I'm going grocery shopping. And that more comes from my social anxiety and not being able to talk to people. So somebody randomly coming up to me and being like, oh my god, I love your videos. I love how much you, you know... You're such a yapper. Like, I would freeze. Here, I can talk. Here, I can yap nonstop. In person, I got issues. <laughs> because I just shut down, unfortunately. And that's not on the person. That's not on you guys at all. That's just how I cope. You know? That's just my anxieties. That's my own fears. And so... Because of that, it's translated into I won't go up to celebrities or YouTubers or anything like that. Doesn't mean I don't want to meet them, you know? <laughs> I would love to meet some of my favorite YouTubers, you know? I'd love to meet them be like, hey, oh my gosh, you know? Um, but I, I understand that there's a level there. Uh, buying merch, buying songs, buying stuff like that. Thank you. <laughs> Like, obviously, I don't have any merch right now or anything like that, but, like, people who do do that for others and support others like that, you're awesome. You're wonderful. You know? You have my, my utmost respect here. <laughs> because, you know, that's just good. You know? You're supporting that creator. You're supporting them, and you're helping them to pay rent, <laughs> get groceries for the day. Stuff like that, and and so I don't find fans who do that bad. I feel like those fans who do that and then also are respectful are even better. But the ones who buy merch and just assume that 
they get all access to that creator, I don't like. Because again, you're not paying for the person. You are paying for the product and the branding of the product, if you want to be specific. That person has their own life. That person has their own things going. For example, I haven't streamed in a little bit. Um, because I had personal things going on that made me not be able to stream for a little bit. Uh, but I will get back to it, I swear. But if somebody got mad at me because I didn't stream, dude, I'm a human being. I, there's nuances here. Um, there are times where things are going to happen, you know? There are times when you want alone time and to be by yourself. So yeah, I just wanted to talk about that a bit, um, and see your guys' opinion on it too, because like, I'm coming from the side of a creator myself, you know? And obviously my opinions aren't end-all, be-all, my word is law, you know? <laughs> no, not all. People can have different opinions. Um, I was just curious and wanted to start a conversation about it. <laughs> Apparently six minute long conversation. Uh, I hope you enjoyed. I hope you come and talk to me about this and have a wonderful day and goodbye.